Aqueducts were monumental feats of engineering by ancient Romans. They transported water over long distances to urban centers. The Romans built their aqueducts with precision, showcasing their engineering prowess and ability to overcome geographic challenges. Key materials used included stone, brick, and cement, which helped ensure the durability and longevity of these structures. Roman engineers used techniques like gradients and siphons to move water efficiently across varied terrains. They constructed aqueducts mostly underground, only building striking arches where necessary. Arch construction enabled aqueducts to span valleys and rivers, demonstrating architectural innovation. Aqueducts had profound impacts on Roman society, providing water for public baths, fountains, and households. The surplus of water allowed for cleaner cities, improved public health, and better sanitation. Increased agricultural irrigation from aqueducts led to more stable food supplies and urban growth. The Aqua Appia was the first aqueduct built in 312 BC, marking the beginning of Roman water management. Aqua Claudia, completed in 52 AD, exemplified the height of Roman engineering with its massive structures. Pont du Gard in France is one of the best preserved aqueducts outside Italy, showcasing Roman architectural influence. Roman aqueducts inspired future generations and influenced modern water management and architectural design. Many of today's water systems still reflect Roman principles and their emphasis on sustainability. Roman aqueducts were a testament to human creativity and served as the backbone of Roman civilization. Through their ingenuity, the Romans laid the foundation for modern engineering and urban planning.